फाइंड दी फोर ए साइन ट्रांसफॉर्म ऑफ एफ ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू ई टू द पावर माइनस मॉड एक्स एंड हेंस इवेलुएट इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ जीरो टू इन्फिनिटी एक्स इन टू साइन एम एक्स अपॉन वन प्लस एक्सक्वेर इज एक्सक्वेर विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स एम इज ग्रेटर दैन जीरो सो फर्स्ट वी फाइंड फोर ए साइन ट्रांसफॉर्म आफ्टर सो दिस इज इक्वल टू सो फर्स्ट फोर ए साइन ट्रांसफॉर्म द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज यूजिंग इनवर्स साइन ट्रांसफॉर्म Okay. Now solution. Now four year sine transform is given. F s of u is equal to integration of zero to infinity. F of x into sine u x. With respect to x, okay. Now, integration of zero to infinity f of x is a e to the power e to the power minus mod x into sine u x with respect to x. Uh, this is equal to integration of zero to infinity e raised to minus x mod means plus or minus minus x into Sine u x with respect to x. So how will get mine e to the power minus x? It's like this. Minus infinity to plus infinity is zero. Now e to the power minus mod x. This is a negative side and this is a positive side. E to the power minus negative means minus x. E to the power minus. This side is a zero to infinity is so a positive side plus x means e raised to minus x only zero to infinity. Now using standard formula, we know the standard formula is e raised to a x into sine b x with respect to x is equal to e raised to a x upon a square plus b square into a sine b x minus b cos b x. This is the formula. Now a means what? Minus one. B means u. So using this standard formula is e raised to minus x upon a means minus one square plus b means u u square into a into a is a minus one minus sine u x minus b means u okay this u u cos u x with limits zero to infinity okay now. First to apply the limit, e raised to infinity is a zero. Zero into this is zero minus lower limit. E raised to zero is a one. One upon one plus u square. Right. Sine zero is a zero. Zero minus cos zero is a one. Minus u is remaining. E raised to zero equal to one. Sine zero is a zero and cos zero is a one. Put x is equal to both limit. Now f s of u is a u upon one plus u square minus into minus plus. Now go to the inverse Fourier transform. Now by inverse Fourier sine transform. So f of x is equal to two by pi integration of zero to infinity f s of u means the means this one using here into sine u x with respect to u and f of x. Okay. Now f of x is equal to what is a given. e is to minus x or oh, sorry e is to minus e to the power minus mod x now f of x is a e is to minus x minus mod x equal to 2 by pi integration of 0 to infinity and f of u this f of u is a 
u upon 1 plus u square sin ux with respect to u. Now put x is equal to m. When you put x is equal to m, but m is positive, greater than 0, means f of x is equal to what? e to the power minus mod m or e raised to minus m, positive side. Now this is a cross multiply. Mm, I'll write first e raised to minus m equal to 2 by pi integration of 0 to infinity uh, x is equal to m x is equal to m this is 1 x is equal to m uh, u into sin u m sorry sin m u divided by 1 plus u square with respect to u this is cross multiply this is a cross multiply uh, pi by 2 into e raised to minus m is equal to integration of 0 to infinity u sin m u by 1 plus u square next is by changing by changing the variable variable is we change u to x now therefore integration of this is with respect to u u to x means 0 to infinity u is equal to x sin mx by 1 plus x square with respect to x is equal to pi by 2 into e raised to minus m this is a required solution